Hi parents, I hope everybody has been staying safe and I hope you guys are enjoying your time with your kids. I just wanted to upload a video to kind of show you guys and help you out when logging into Clever. I'm going to show you a couple of ways that you can actually do it so that you and your kiddos can use all of our resources here from the school and from different places um, and use it wisely during these I guess two weeks of review. Um, the first way that I'm going to show you is through NC Ed Cloud, which is the student login portal. If you have an iPad or an Apple device, one of the ways that you can do it is logging in here through Safari. So the first thing you'll do is click on Safari. You're going to click at the very top and you're just going to put my.ncedcloud dot org once you click that you'll press go and it will take you to the login page this right here is where you would put in your students um your students student number or id number which i have sent you guys through messages so you can do that or you can also use the qr code i'm going to use the number as i find that to be a little bit easier for myself so you would click in their number, you press go, and here they will put in their password. Our students' passwords are all the same. It is a capital C, M, S, X, two, zero, three, one. All right, once they log into here, they'll be able to get on different resources. Theirs might look a little different. Mine's is the teacher one, so it might not look the same. All of our resources, if not the majority of our resources, will be under Clever. So students will click here. And once they get here, they will click on this middle box, the one that says Login with NC Ed Cloud. Once they click here, it will take them through and it will take them here to all of the resources that they can click on. So up here, they have Edgenuity, they have RAS Kids, they have um, Epic, they'll have ReadWorks, Read Theory. It will show them all of the ones that they can log into and it will automatically take them to where they need to go. Now, this, like I said, is just one way that they can log in to use these resources. If you have any questions, please let me know.